Merry Christmas, everyone. Thank you so much, Ashu, for inviting me to this awesome Christmas collaboration. It is always an honor to work with these talented artists. I hope that you enjoyed Oak by Bettina before me. Now let's get you started with my Christmas painting. Now for the colors, I used Deco Arts Metallic Berry, Master's Touch Viridian, Dallaroni's Portrait Pink. The white is a mixture of whites with satin enamel off-white. And then there's a gold mixture in there that is Arteza Gold and 24K Gold mixed together. And the darker green is phthalo green. And... Then there's a magenta in there. I think that is all the colors that are in there. I will have them listed in the description for you as well. And all of my paints are just mixed with paint, Floetrol, and water. I really liked how it was looking right here. But unfortunately, my metallic berry starts gobbling some stuff up and changes the look of it a little bit so i end up coming in and giving it some gold swipes I'm assessing the damage right now. I haven't quite decided to do the swipes yet. It's coming. And I'm also noticing that all of my gold is gone. I'm sure you can tell from the way that I'm tilting this canvas which part of this painting I'm not digging. It's that part over there at the top that's got the big metallic cells coming up. I am not happy with that at all. So when all else fails, what does Brenda do? Well, I have it on a spinner, so I had to spin it. It didn't help me any. It didn't help me to create anything that I was wanting to. But that's me. I had to spin it anyway. I finally decided to go for those swipes. I wished I would have stepped back and looked at it from a distance a couple of times while I was doing this. I would have done my swipes a little differently, I think.
Still not happy about those berry cells, but they're there. And as you see, a few more metallic berries pop up. That's because the thinner I get the paint, the more I am giving that metallic berry the chance to come up to the surface. This painting changed quite a bit from that moment when I told you that I really liked how the painting looked at that point. I was okay with how the painting turned out, but I did end up deciding to embellish it. I am on this huge embellishing kick, if you haven't noticed, and I have to embellish everything. So, after I get done showing you these details here, I will show you the dry results and then I will show you the embellishments. This embellishment went through many stages. I do hope you enjoyed the process of this Christmas painting. Thank you for being here. Please do follow up with Marie Louise Art. She is after me today. I'll see you over there at her channel. Merry Christmas, everybody. Thank you again, Ashu, for having me, and I will see you all over at Marie Louise Art Channel.